One of the major problems that we experience today is pollution. Pollution of the air, water, and land causes by toxic like plastic and heavy metals. These materials are useful yet harmful for the environment. If we keep producing and consuming these materials, they will end up staying in our environment until future generation. That's why we need to be more responsible when consuming them. Responsible consumption means something that we do for the environment to be clean. The first step that we can do to be responsible for the environment or to help the environment to be clean is segregate their waste into biodegradable and non-biodegradable waste. That can be composed naturally. And examples of it are some food and some drinks and some wood. Non-biodegradable means that we can recycle it, but it takes a lot of years to decompose. It like takes 500 years, or it can take up to 1,000 years to decompose. By that, that can stop. That is only Take good care of your things so that it will last longer and don't need to buy a new one. Do not use single-use plastic. Segregate the plastic from other trash so that we can send it to the factory to recycle it. My last project's material. You don't just save money, but we also save the environment by producing less waste. We can minimize our waste by Instead doing of three arts, reduce, reduce, and recycle. The first one is reduce. Reduce means lessen the use of everything. Look, paper bag. Instead of plastic bags. Do not buy bottle water and bring your own water jug to produce less waste. Use a thermos at a coffee shop. I get bigger supplies. I get bigger packaging than, than smaller packaging. Reuse means to use something repeatedly. Ways to reuse. Number one, use old tin cans to make storage containers. Use old cans as a flower pot. Use old aluminum cans as a pencil holder. I reuse a plastic to make a tent. The, the tent is for sleeping and 
safe and to keep warm. This is what I use. I can use the plastic to put food and can put fork and spoon. We can also recycle. We can out of plastic waste. This is my this is my recycled flower pot plastic container for the vase. I need stickers for the design and 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 soil and a plant to grow the the plant you need a seed and some water and then soil. I made this puppet using socks, some rib some yarn for the hair, and then some like a uh, bottle cups and then some cardboard for the eyes and then a ribbon for the head thank you for watching good morning today i'm going to show i'm going to tell you what i can do with my plastic cup made out of wasted materials from plastic we can put water in it in case you don't have a normal cup. You can you can put water in it so that you can drink so that you won't be thirsty at the camping trip. Next up, if you can if you want to wash your hair or face, you can maybe get some water out of a river or any place that has water that you you can put water in it to wash your hair by putting the water on, on your hair or face. The last one is you can put toothbrushes and toothpaste in there so that if you still have a if you have somewhere close where the water is, you can put water in it to brush your teeth also so that you will still have clean teeth by the morning and night. Goodbye and thank you for watching. Goodbye. Fun. This is a bottle you can use it from camping to drink. If if you cut it a half, you can make it a candle or a light. And if you cut it, you can it look like a bottle, but it's a tea. You can drink tea. Good morning everyone, I am Tyler Mantor Sim and today I am going to sh show you what I recycled in music. And this is a cardboard flute. To make it, you need some cardboard, some... Today I have finished with some the so, using malaka Kasi kung unidad magyaring wag magtapon ng basura sa karagatan at pangyaring sundin ang tatlong ars na reduce news recycle kailangan natin gawin ang tatlong ars upang piligtas ang kapaligiran at ating buhay na sabay na oras dahil ang kapaligiran ay ang ating buhay mula kay Tyler Matuso. Para sa mga mama mayan magandang araw ako ay si Sean mag-aaral ng CKS isa din akong Mamamayan ng ating komun komun id 
Dan sumulat ako sa inyo upang matulogan yo ako pang alagaan ang ating kapal diran huwag tayong magtapon ng basura kung saan saan atin iwasan natin ang pag ng mga puno tandaan ang reduce, reuse, and risk at at recycle ang iyong kapit bahay sa mahal kong komunidad kung maaari la la mang po na pana Ilihinatin na malinis ang paligid sa pamamagitan ng pagtapon ng ating basura sa tamang basurahan upang hindi masira ang ating kalikasan mula kay Lorraine.